Here it is, actual letters from actual viewers. Let's begin tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Letter number one, dear Dave. Uh, <clears throat> I am writing you in hopes that you will use my suggestions. One, quit. <laughs> Two, let Paul host the show. <laughs> Three, crawl in a hole and die. <laughs> Respectfully yours, Stephanie Nauman, Elmwood, Illinois. Oh my gosh, thank you very much, Stephanie. What a, say, what a lovely letter this is. <laughs> Hey, and you know, folks, now you too can receive mail like this thanks to a delightful new book entitled Prozac Pen Pals. There you go. <laughs> Thousands of listings coast to coast and around the world. <laughs> Letter number two. And you know what's fun to do if you're at home watching the show? Count along with me as I count out the letters. Okay. Letter number two. Letter number two. Oh, no, no, Paul, at home if you're watching. Oh, at home. <laughs> oh, I see. Not here in the studio. Letter number two. <laughs> Dear Dave, boo. <laughs> Did I scare you? Just asking. <laughs> Natalie Chambers, Davenport, Iowa. <laughs> this is very amusing. No, of course you didn't scare me. You, I mean, writing boo in a letter never really scared anyone. <laughs> right, Paul? I mean, that would never, Paul, that would never scare anybody, would it? <laughs> Paul. Hey, Paul. Paul, it's just... It's, settle down, it's just a, uh, it's a viewer mail letter, that's all it is. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I got, I'm a little jumpy. Yeah, there. I guess you're <laughs> jumpy. Goodness, what a ninny. Uh, letter number three. At home, people. Uh, oh, <laughs> uh, dear Dave, boy, are you goofy looking. Just some constructive criticism, Brian DeMarco. I knew it. I knew I was goofy looking. I'm goofy looking, aren't I? Isn't it? Hey, 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 give me the relax. mirror there, Bill. You're, you're not goofy looking. Here's a mirror. Oh, Take good. How did you know I wanted that mirror? <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks for bringing the mirror, Biff. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, no, geez, I'm actually, I'm actually pretty. Yeah, that's great. Thank God I'm not goofy looking, am I, Biff? No, Dave, you're not goofy looking, but you are awfully stupid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. yeah. But boy, I, you know, I, I was just thinking maybe if I had a mirror and boom, there was Biff there right was there with the mirror. With the mirror. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Letter number four. Dear Dave, has anyone ever bled to death from a paper cut? I must know. Uh, sincerely, T. Flanagan, uh, Metuchen, New Jersey. Uh, it's an excellent question, uh, T. Uh, <laughs> So we put together a little experiment uh, backstage. Let me go check on this. We got a guy who actually cut himself with a uh, sheet of uh, writing paper, and he's bleeding now. Let's just go see if he's bleeding to death. Well, let's uh, just take a second. We'll come back here and find out uh, how, how it's going. Hi there. Hi. How's it going, Larry? Are you all right? Fine. Just fine. Uh -huh. I'm a little bored. Yeah, right. You say you're a little bored? A little bored. Yeah, well, the audience feels the same way. Uh, so are, are you bleeding to death? Not me. I'm in the top physical condition of my life. Uh -huh. Except, of course, for the mouth. Uh, so, uh, thank you very much for helping us out with this uh, experiment, and uh, we'll get you a sponge to clean up, okay? Don't mention it, Elvis. We <laughs> did. Yeah, and I'm telling you, you know you're hot when stuff like that happens. He says, don't mention it, Elvis. Here's the card. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> well, well, <laughs> don't mention it Regis. Yeah, don't mention it Regis. But you know, in his defense, I think exit might have confused him. Right. I think he saw that as a uh, Elvis. Right. Yeah. 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 Elvis. Right. Well, he's lost, you know. <laughs> he's lost a lot of blood. <laughs> he's, he's a little woozy. <laughs> The place, the place is hopping with surprise entertainment tonight. Uh, let us now do a commercial. When we come back, our friend David Steinberg will be here, kids. <laughs>